that you have, you got a tattoo in your foot that says just be right? mm-hmm. and <laughs> you have spoke about i heard you mention make a statement where you said usually when somebody's career is skyrocketing something else isn't good right yeah. Yeah. so you being as driven as you are you even spoke like you've admitted that you're so driven no matter what you accomplish at times you feel like it's never enough so i'm wondering yeah. like how do you juggle that juxtaposition <laughs> right to be somebody that no matter what I do, it's never enough. But at mm-hmm. the same time, you want to live truth to your, your tattoo that says just be. Mm-hmm. How do you how do you juggle that? You know what I'm saying? Especially in, in the field like like you in. OK, two things. Everything now I do is not for my ego. It's gotcha. to carry the message. It's okay. to entertain. It's to like if I take a job, I'm there to be of service, to be one of many. Like it's not about me. That's the first thing. And it's gratitude. It's mm, it's very, gratitude. That is the much. only thing yes. that gets your feet right where you are. And it's mm-hmm. like mm-hmm. gratitude. Yes. There you so go. that is what has helped me stay driven because I'm just a yeah. driven person. I'm juggling tons of stuff. But I also know like it's gratitude what I have right now. Mm-hmm. Like, is it, is this is, my life is beautiful. Mm-hmm. If I get more, that's great. If I mm-hmm. don't, that's okay too. Can I mm-hmm. live in what is now? Can you believe that's a huge- Digest in this moment like, before me. you can take in the next one. You know what Like I'm saying? make that yeah. decision yeah. is gratitude because I had to understand that bitch, you're tripping. Like, you, yeah, I do. Like, um, you mean like, what did you need again? Why are you doing this? <laughs> I had to be honest, like for real. Like, there's some really like, I had to be really like, okay, it wasn't the best or my own. Like, I just made all this money on my own, and I'm so sick. No, it's not. But I'm okay. My bills are paid. I have a car. My kids are okay. We have what we need. There's like nothing I yeah. need now. There's a whole bunch of shit I want. But I got everything I need. And that was the, I swear, I well, like. Well, the- I had a bunch of shit that I wanted and I wasn't happy. And I had, and I think the yeah. big thing with being in Los Angeles, with mm-hmm. being in the 12 step world, which a lot of actors, a lot of big people are, you know, you're sitting right. in a room in a plastic chair in a circle with 80 other people. You look next to you. It's a huge celebrity that's right. on their knees crying, like yes. miserable. And I, I'm the one that gets to help them and say, yeah, yeah. like you're going to be okay, but you mm-hmm. have to like go away from whatever you're doing, get away from the porn, get away yep. from the prostitutes, get away from that girl that keeps cheating on you and I get to be of service to them. So it's like a constant reminder to me that you could have everything in the world and still have nothing. I've been saying that for so long. I'm like, listen, it doesn't matter what you got. How we you all got. die. We're all put in the dirt together. We're all put in the dirt. <laughs> and there, like I said, there's people going through it in a mansion or living in a box. It yeah. don't matter. We are like you- too much of the same. And I yeah. think it's just, it, I'm telling you, that's the point of the show. Like, let's get mm-hmm. real. Let's be, let's yeah. really tell the truth. Right? <laughs> you know what I mean? You, like, yeah. it's cute and all like to have this or look like that or whatever. But let's, let's talk about what's really going on with us and start healing. Yeah. You know? 